Welcome to my channel RX Sam 2020. Today we discuss a drug named Febaxostat. About Febaxostat is a non-purine, selective xanthine oxidase inhibitor that converts xanthine and hypoxanthine to uric acid. Thus, it helps in reducing serum uric acid levels. National Institute for Health and Clinical Excellence concluded that febaxostat is more effective than standard doses of allopurinol, but not more effective than higher doses of allopurinol. Medical Use Febaxostat is used to treat chronic gout, hyperuricemia and cancer therapy-induced hyperuricemia. What is Hyperuricemia or hyperuricemia is an abnormally high level of uric acid in the blood. In the pH conditions of body fluid, uric acid exists largely as urate, the ion form. Serum uric acid concentrations greater than 6 mg per dl for females, 7 mg per dl for men and 5.5 mg per dl for youth under 18 years old are defined as hyperuricemia. Causes many factors contribute to hyperuricemia, including genetics, insulin resistance. Insulin resistance is when cells in your muscles, fat and liver don't respond well to insulin and can't easily take up glucose from your blood. Hypertension, hypothyroidism, chronic kidney disease, chronic kidney disease, CKD, is a condition in which the kidneys are damaged and cannot filter blood as well as they should. Obesity, diet, iron overload, hemochromatosis or iron overload is a condition in which your body stores too much iron. Use of diuretics, for example thiazides, loop diuretics and excessive consumption of alcoholic beverages. Of these, alcohol consumption is the most important. Gout is a form of inflammatory arthritis characterized by recurrent attacks of a red, tender, hot and swollen joint caused by the deposition of needle-like crystals of uric acid known as monosodium urate crystals. Pain typically comes on rapidly, reaching maximal intensity in less than 12 hours. The joint at the base of the big toe is affected, podagra, in about half of the cases. It may also result in tophi, kidney stones, or kidney damage. Contraindications Ischemic heart disease and congestive heart failure A liver function test is recommended before febaxostat therapy. Special precautions Febaxostat treatment should not be started until an acute attack of gout has completely subsided. Flares of gout may increase after febaxostat administration as uric acid moves out of tissues. Flare prophylaxis for 6 months is recommended. Cancer, kidney disease, organ transplant. Patient with a history of hypersensitivity reaction to allopurinol. Pregnancy, not recommended. Breastfeeding, not recommended. Monitoring Parameters Monitor LFTs at baseline and periodically thereafter, serum uric acid levels to weeks after initiation of treatment baseline renal function. Monitor cardiac function as clinically indicated in patients undergoing chemotherapy for hematologic malignancies at intermediate to high risk of TLS. Tumor Lysis Syndrome Tumor Lysis Syndrome TLS is a condition that occurs when a large number of cancer cells die within a short period, releasing their contents into the blood. Assess for gout flares and signs or symptoms of cardiovascular events. Cardiovascular events refer to any incidence that may cause damage to the heart muscle, liver injury and hypersensitivity or severe skin reactions. Drug Interactions Febaxostat is contraindicated with concomitant use of theophylline and chemotherapeutic agents, 
namely azathioprine and 6 mercaptocurine because it could increase blood plasma concentrations of these drugs and thereby their toxicity side effects common side effects are diarrhea headache nausea edema swelling rash joint pain and increased serum hepatic enzyme levels hepatic enzyme levels the normal range of values for ast sgot is about 5 to 40 units per liter of serum the liquid part of the blood the normal range of values for alt sgpt is about 7 to 56 units per liter of serum whereas the serious side effects of febaxostat include heart problems liver problems or abnormal liver function and severe skin and allergic reactions brand names that are mostly prescribed by doctors adenuric atenuric barif feburic uloric dosage may be taken with or without food may be taken without regard to antacid use oral hyperuricemia adult for chronic cases in patients with gout or urate deposition including a history or presence of tophus and or gouty arthritis initially 40 mg once daily the dose may be increased to 80 mg once daily if serum uric acid is greater than 6 mg per dl after 2 weeks alternatively 80 mg once daily may increase the dose to 120 mg once daily if serum uric acid is greater than 6 mg per dl after 2 to 4 weeks gout flare prophylaxis for at least 6 months with nonsteroidal anti-inflammatory drugs or colchicine is recommended at treatment initiation oral cancer therapy induced hyperuricemia adult prophylaxis and treatment of cases in patients undergoing chemotherapy for hematologic malignancies at intermediate to high risk of tumor lysis syndrome tls 120 mg once daily started to days before the beginning of cytotoxic therapy and continued for 7 to 9 days based on chemotherapy duration renal impairment hyperuricemia creatinine clearance is less than 30 ml per minute then the maximum dosage is 40 mg once daily hepatic impairment hyperuricemia mild maximum 80 mg daily what foods should be avoided while taking this medicine avoid meat and beef as these can increase uric acid levels You are advised to maintain a good amount of water intake while on this medicine. Mechanism of actions. Febaxostat is a non-purine selective inhibitor of xanthine oxidase. It works by non-competitively blocking the molybdenum terrin center, which is the active site of xanthine oxidase. Xanthine oxidase is needed to oxidize hypoxanthine and xanthine to uric acid successively thus febaxostat inhibits xanthine oxidase thereby reducing the production of uric acid febaxostat inhibits both the oxidized and the reduced forms of xanthine oxidase by virtue of its tight binding to the molybdenum terrin site thank you for watching please like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get video updates